Hello everyone and welcome to Food Review UK. My name is Michael Jameson and today we are reviewing cucumber with mint. Now we have reviewed cucumber on the channel before and quite frankly I didn't actually like it. I described it as salad water. I do need to give a big thank you to the people at Cucumber for sending me this product. Uh, I, was, I was pretty relentless to be fair. Uh, I was, I didn't, actually I didn't know that this one existed with the mint. But I basically was doing the A to Z soda which you may have seen on the channel. I needed a soda for every single letter of the alphabet and Q, what do you know, not a very popular letter for words slash sodas. This was the only one that I could find and I mean, I mean knew about. I couldn't find the product physically anywhere. Like I literally couldn't find it anywhere. Apparently it's uh, in Tesco and co-op. I went in about f six co-ops and about three Tesco's. Tesco branches. Couldn't find it anywhere. Anyway, messaged them back and forth on Twitter. Uh, after a bit of a uh, bit of haggling, bit of debating, they finally sent it to me. Uh, I did. I did offer to, uh, to pay. By the way, I'm not not looking for handouts. I did say I'm more than happy to pay. Just to make that clear to anyone questioning my moral fibre. But anyway, yeah, I eventually got it, and it was a, a mint variety. So I thought, you know, why not? Instead of just using it for the A to Z soda, let's pay them their dues and do a review. Uh, the only slight problem is I don't think I'm going to like it. But hey. They sent it to me, so I've got to be nice, and so what I'll say, I'm not, not saying I'm not going to be honest, because I'm probably not going to like it, but what I will say is, if you like cucumber, you might like it. So don't, you know, take your own opinion as well as mine. Smells of cucumber. I can't smell the mint. Oh, actually, tell a lie. I can smell a very, very hint of mint. Right, let's go for it. Actually, I bloody love mint in a drink. I just bloody hate cucumber in one. Mmm. Okay, good. Good aftertaste. Not a fan of the pre-taste, i.e. the middle taste. Um, yeah, mostly cucumber in the smell. About 90% cucumber in the actual flavour when it's in your mouth. Actually, I will say that is a lot more bearable than the normal flavour. Mmm. Yeah, about 90% cucumber when it's actually in your mouth. 10% mint, and then the aftertaste. The aftertaste is actually really nice. It's like mainly mint, I'd say 90% mint, 10% cucumber in the aftertaste, which is actually a really good ratio. That's uh, The cucumber gives it quite a fresh, crisp, palate cleansing approach flavor. Meh. Far, far better than the, uh, than the regular one, which I didn't like at all. I'd give that a uh, pretty high two stars. Hmm. Yeah, nice aftertaste. I just can't get can't get on board with the main flavour. But if you're the kind of person that likes, uh, I guess Gordon's um, gin and cucumber, probably like that. Thanks very much for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out my comedy channel, Michael Jameson Comedy, and my vlog channel, The Life of Michael Jameson. I recently went to Germany, so there's a lot of Europa Park and Germany banter vlogs up. Support us on the social medias, you know where to find us, and subscribe for more videos. <laughs> Spells of cucumber. I can't smell the mint. 